Hey guys, it's Ethan, and um, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make some amazing fries just in your oven. Check out this crunch. So good. Alright, let's get cooking. Alright, to start off, the first thing you're going to want to do is preheat your oven to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Once your oven's preheated, you, you want to grab two potatoes, um, some white vinegar, some extra virgin olive oil, and then some black pepper, and some salt, just to season. And then one ingredient I like to add is a little bit of parsley at the end. All right. Once your ingredients are all together, you're gonna go. You're gonna want to grab a big old pot and just start filling that guy up with water. Fill it up as much as like all the way up. Once you have a pot filled up with water, you want to put it on the stove and put that on a medium high heat and just wait for it to boil. Okay. While your water's boiling, you're gonna want to start washing your two potatoes. Is you just put them under some water and rinse them off. After you've rinsed off your potatoes, you're going to want to grab a peeler and start peeling those potatoes. You don't want any skins on there, they have to be completely naked. It takes a bit of time, I know, but it's worth it. Once you've got your potatoes peeled, you're going to want to grab a really sharp knife, a big sharp knife, and start cutting those guys up into um, bigger chunks like you can see here. And then once you got them all cut up into these big chunks, you're going to want to start cutting them into fries. And you can really cut them however thick you want. I like my fries a bit thinner, but you can make them as thick as you want. It's your fries. Alright, and as you can see here, the fries are all done. Now once your water's boiling, you're going to want to add a bit of salt to that boiling water and about two tablespoons of vinegar to help keep the fries from getting mushy in the water, in the boiling water. And then once you're, that stuff's in, you're just going to put the fries in. Simple as that. You're going to want to boil that for about eight minutes on medium high, and then once that's boiled, while that's boiling, you're going to want to get two baking sheets ready. As you can see, the potatoes have finished boiling, and you just want to strain them out and let them steam off. Alright, now that you're finished blanching your potatoes, you're going to want to lay them in these baking sheets like that, and just start drizzling them with some olive oil. Really put a lot on, you, don't, you want them to be soaked and completely cover them all, move them around, and then you want a little bit, a thin layer of olive oil on the bottom, just as you can see here. Yep, they're all coated, and they're ready for the oven. Just put all your fries in that middle baking rack in the oven, and it's going to be at 450 degrees Fahrenheit. It should be ready by now if you start preheating at the beginning. Alright, these guys are going to go in for about 30 minutes, and you're going to want to take them out halfway through like I'm doing here, and just flip them over, and then put them back in for the remaining 50 minutes. Alright, once your french fries have finished baking, you're going to want to get a really big bowl and line it with some paper towels or some napkins and just start dropping your fries in there so that you can drain off any of the excess oil that will be on there from the baking process. And then as soon as they're in there, you're going to want to hit them with a bit of salt, salt to your uh, liking, and then I hit it with some parsley too. And then you just shake it all up and 
and that's it. The fries are pretty much done. And then you're just going to want to get a plate and plate them up. And that's the whole recipe. Alright, thanks guys for watching my video. I hope you guys had fun and are going to do some cooking. So, thanks for watching. <laughs>